When it comes to Budokai Tenkaichi 4, there's some characters that I definitely want to see from the Dragon Ball universe. And we're going to get into them today. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I do these videos all the time. Let's start with the first person I want to see inside of Dragon Ball Tenkaichi 4 as a playable character. I definitely want to see Fused Zamasu. You know what I'm saying? I feel like we're going to get Goku Black. We're going to get Zamasu. But Fused Zamasu would be crazy. If you know, you know he took on two blue forms. And he had to get... Uh, I'm not even going to spoil it for you guys. But like, man. You guys know if you saw this arc. If you saw these episodes. That this guy is kind of cracked. And there's only a few ways to kind of beat him. So I wonder what it would be like. To have him in the game if you watch dragon ball superhero you know these next two that are coming up that i want to see in the game the though these may be transformations of the original characters we know that when it comes to budokai tenkaichi they count all the transformations as their own individual characters for the most part maybe that changes this time maybe it doesn't we'll know when we get some zenny to go to the shop you know what i'm saying buy from popo but i want to see orange piccolo Piccolo's first and only full transformation where he looks completely different in terms of color because unlike Saiyans, he doesn't have the hair. You know what I mean? The hair transformations and stuff like that or like those kind of color transformations that we see with God and blue, etc. But this was his first official one that we got to see where he com completely, completely changes that's com considered canon and it's orange Piccolo. I want to see orange Piccolo in it. By extension, you already know, like I said, if you know the next two from this movie, yeah, we're doing it. We're doing Gohan Beast. I want to see that transformation come through crazy. This is not Ultra Instinct. This is not anything else. This is a full on new transformation that is exclusive to Gohan. If you just want to call it Beast, that's what they call it as well. Gohan Beast transformation is absolutely disgusting. You guys gotta go watch Dragon Ball Super Hero, Dragon Ball Super Superhero, in order to find it. You know what I mean? Uh, I gotta see these two in the game, hundred percent. Next up is the Patora fusion of Kale and Khalifa. You know what I'm saying? I wanna see Tesla. Man, the episodes you already know what it's like, bro. If you saw that epic moment. I'm not even going to spoil it for you if you've never seen it. By now, most people have seen it. But I just need to play that specific part in the game. I don't care if it's a story. I don't care if we can make it a side thing. I don't care if it's on a storyboard or like, you know what I mean? Where you, you, you use the, the pieces to go like a board game. I need to see that and be able to mash buttons and everything like that in the game. I need that scene. If you, if you know, you know. But we need Kefla for sure the next person i gotta see in the game is Fu. i want Fu to be able to use who as the dark king formation you know what i mean i want to see his all his forms who is definitely one of those guys to me who's like he's super mysterious he's a nerd looking motherfucker, but he's like you know he's strong he's different he's that guy i want to see definitely who in budokai tenkai or next up we got the assassin himself the mr never miss hit that's right he thought i want to see a hit in there he's the, the universe six captain come on now he was one of those guys he is him hit is him bro he's one of the ones so if we don't get hit in the game it's obvious that we're gonna get him in the game this is based off super but like i need to see him bro this is what, what would this video be without speculation and things like that come on now we gotta see a hit and last but not least you guys could have guessed this one for sure I didn't say Goku Black because I picked a few Zamasu, so you know, like, that's already in there. But Jiren. Jiren is one of the guys. He's the guy, and it's going to be epic. The battles are going to be epic. If we get all of the battles that we need out of this one, and they break them down properly into each individual, like, each individual thing could be its own stage. If you understand what I'm trying to say, like, we can have multiple, multiple battles just on across multiple stages kind of thing you, you feel me like we can get each part of each episode kind of thing in its own little five minute six minute segment of gameplay where we get to mash and actually put in the inputs and do things properly like versus jiren or playing as jiren is going to be crazy not no dragon ball fighters type ish this is just like 
he's gonna be crazy it's like almost like the thing i love about budokai tenkaichi as like in the budokai games like that is fighting it's like it's like playing tekken it's like a 3d arena battle you know what i'm saying instead of the 2d platformer battle style fighting game so jiren is gonna be crazy because we're gonna be knocking people through rocks and formations you know what i mean lots of things going on with this one so i'm gonna see i want to see jiren i see jiren as the last one and my total like i was saying all of them i want to see yuzumasu orange pickle gohan beast or beast gohan kefla boom hit and jiren as a total in the next budokai Tenchai tenkaichi game make sure you guys like comment subscribe if you enjoyed the video i do these all the time peace